Bill Simpson was an African-American who was mysteriously murdered the day he fled a failed experiment in forced desegregation in Texas's most notoriously racist town, Vider. The Least of My Brothers is a documentary film that is the culmination of five years of research into what really happened. This film includes news footage and exclusive interviews with first-hand witnesses. So he, he took a walk that night, I think it was about 1045, September 1st, 1993. And it was at the corner of Victoria and Royal in Beaumont. He was with a woman named Lydia Faye Washington, 40 years old. At the time, Simpson was 37. I think he'd had a couple of beers. The autopsy report said his blood alcohol level was 0.11, which is just a little bit above legal intoxication. But you understand Simpson was more than seven feet tall, 300 pounds. So he's walking down the street, and then a car pulls up with four guys inside and two masked gunmen get out. We went to the store. And we went and got us a four ounce. And he said, well, come on, sister, we're going to get us a meal, four ounce. And I told him I was going to walk me and my daughter. We were going back home. And we stood on the corner. And the boys just kept riding and riding and riding. A car had passed by, and they had yelled out something. And then the next car had passed by about five or ten minutes later, another car had came up and two boys had got out the car. He came over there where we was, and he said, all right, let's lay it down. And nobody moves. I, was, I told my mom, I said, mom, just do what they say do, just because I thought they just, you know, they're to rob us or something. According to initial police statements, two African-Americans with their faces covered got out of the car. Like, like, like this here, with their face all covered up, but like, you could see their eyes. You could see their eyes, but you couldn't see, their, you know, their mouth and nose. They asked Bill Simpson, give me your money, and we ain't had no money. He said, I ain't got no kind of money. He said, I ain't got but $2.15. And they still didn't even pull that out. <laughs> and they shot him instantly. One grab for Miss Washington's purse, and then shot her in the leg or knee three or four times. The man then shot Simpson in the legs, hips, and torsos. I think the autopsy report ended up that he, he'd been shot five times. He was shot with a semi-automatic pistol. Uh, later, it was found out that it was a uh, nine millimeter, I think it was a Tech-9. I think Bill Simpson tried to run from the scene, and he was he was shot while he, while he ran. Bill Simpson turned and began to move as rapidly as possible away from the shooter. He had a, a game leg, was disabled in one leg, and he wasn't moving all that fast. And the shooter shot him. He fell on the ground. The shooter went over to Bill Simpson. Bill wasn't moving, bleeding profusely, and turned and started to walk away. He turned and noticed that Bill was still moving, came back, shot him again. Never searched him, turned, and walked away. He died at uh, Baptist Hospital here in Beaumont at 11.40 p.m., about an hour after the incident. Even though I know God has been there with me, he also knows that, that I've taken enough. There were many nights I couldn't sleep, tossing and turning, then lay there wide awake. It's hard when you don't know if anything's going to come about, and if it is, when it's going to come, who's going to be involved in it, how they're going to do it, whether they're going to come by and shoot your house or wait for you to be outside your house. It could have happened inside the, uh, the projects. It could have happened outside. Mm -hmm. um, thank God it never did happen. Do you have peace of mind now? It's a load has been lifted off my shoulders. Yes, I have more peace than I, I felt out there. And that's because, well, this is home. The Carver Library proudly presents The Least of My Brothers this Thursday, March 27th at 6 p.m. The filmmaker will be in attendance to answer questions. Please join us to examine this sadly forgotten but important piece of Texas's black history. The Least of My Brothers this Thursday, March 27th at 6 p.m. The George Washington Carver Museum and Cultural Center is located at 1165 Angelina Street, Austin, Texas. Admission is free.